Hey everybody, this is Matt from Homebodies, and I am making my real first video for techies. Um, what we're going to be doing is we are going to be installing um, a remote desktop on Android phones. Um, I have two examples of Android phones, one with the old Android OS and one with the newer Android OS. Uh, for those of you who have the newer one, I'll be using the HTC Evo. Those of you who are using the older one, we're going to be using Samsung Epic or a Galaxy S. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to get onto our computers and we're going to go. Let me grab the camera here. Position that so that you guys can see this. I'm not going to be able to really see it anyways. Alright Mike, you get, to you get to help. Sweet! Yay! This is my mom's laptop for those of you who actually see the background. It's actually me. Uh, what you're going to do is you're going to go www.teamviewer.com I'll put the link in the description below for those of you who can't see it because it looks like crap. And you're going to hit the download for private use button. And save file. Not the trolls. Run away! Okay. Then you're going to run the setup. The setup is pretty self explanatory. Install. Actually, there's actually a run option if you want to just use it one time to see how it does. I, I'm, I'm installing it for the purpose of multiple uses, and I'm using it for personal. You have to accept and agree. Um, I'm doing. I'm going to go ahead and do the installation type for uh, remote access, so that we can set up a password. I'm not going to use the VPN. And this is the unintended access so that you can set up the computer. You're going to look at random things now, like the light fixture. Whee! Oh, that's kind of weird. It's a picture inside of a picture inside of a picture inside of a picture. Yeah, you do like it long enough and your computer will lag. Um, mom, come type in your password for your team viewer. Oh, everybody, this is my mom. What? She needs to be in the video, mom. Yay! For what? This is for team viewers. This is the remote desktop. Um, I'll get to the. Uh, actually, you know what? I'll go ahead and do the installation for the phone while my mom is doing that. Now, what we're going to do on the phone here is we're going to go to the applications and we're going to go. What is it called on your phone? Mm -hmm. Mom, you updated. Mm -hmm. That's the only thing I have to because I have to do a Gmail update. Alright, well, we're going to use my phone then since I still am rocking the old one. What you're going to do is you're going to go to the market. So the I don't market need to loads do this? Up. You need to go to the little search button, or you can hit the button down there. And then you're going to type in TeamViewer, and it's already got it pulled up, obviously. And then you're going to do TeamViewer for remote desktop, or remote control. And then you're going to hit the install button right there. Once you do it, it's going to pop up with the icon, and it'll be this. This will be the connection that you have when you first manage to get the application open. Obviously it's not going to have a number. Okay, and then what you're going to do is you're going to type in And then I'm going to have my mom type in the password over here. 
This is how it should do, look after you've gone and put in all your personal information. Oh, snap. We, oh, we're going to have to edit that, dude. You want password sitting right there? No, that's not our password. Oh, well, no. that's the dynamic password. Oh, that's the dynamic password. Okay. So it's not the real, real password. No. So you can hit this lovely button right here and it. Oh, okay. You were blacklisted or not whitelisted by this partner. I don't know what that means. Facebook pull up. You can use, you know, oh, Team Viewer Crash. But there you go, guys. That's a quick video on how to do it. Installation for the phone and for your computer. If you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, uh, go ahead and leave a comment down below. Um, if you like this video, subscribe, you know, thumbs up, whatever you want to do. Um, there's anything else that you would like to add, Michael? Nope. Please, please do something now. No? Okay. Well, um, see you next time, guys.